Hi, I'm Umberto Leon, and this is Yoko Ono. For this holiday season, we are honored to present Yoko's new clothing line, Fashions for Men, 1969-2012. Fashion for Men! <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about your drawings you made for John as a wedding present that inspired this collection. It's such a pleasure to tell you about that. Uh, for the wedding, well, there was no real wedding, but I mean for <laughs> getting together, that um, I created these drawings because I really felt that it was time to have an equal stage, uh, men and women. And somehow I felt that men should go a step further from uh, the tie and the suit kind of situation. And what was his reaction when, when you gave it to him? Oh, he was very happy about it. Yeah. He was, I don't know, everything that I did in my artwork, I must say that he, each time he was kind of like, wow, okay, thank you, you know. <laughs> Now, why do you think this was a fitting wedding present for John? Well, you know, he was a very kind of a forward-thinking person. Yeah. And also, he had a really beautiful body, and I thought I was actually uh, inspired by that. And was your state of mind very kind of calm at the time, or...? Uh, more rebellious, maybe. Oh, okay. <laughs> As a woman. <laughs> Let, let us see what you are. Yeah. That's what I was saying. <laughs> I love that. Um, and now, was it, how was it seeing these drawings come to life three-dimensionally through this collaboration? Seeing every piece, you know, the jackets, us making it. Well, that has uh, a lot to do with your courage <laughs> for doing it. Uh, I think that this is going to uh, wake up people a little, maybe, and uh, uh, relax men in a way that, oh. It's all right for us to sort of show what we are, you yeah. know. Um, what is your first memory of clothing? My mother and my father were very, very conscious about uh, clothes. Okay. And yeah. my mother always said, the shoes, your shoes and the hat will have to go totally, you know, together. They have to match. Yeah. That's they what my mom always said. They have to match. And I learned about it. Uh, well, I think my mother has started to teach me about that when I was two, two years old. Okay. And I remember it. You do? Yes. Do you still practice that? Do you still think about no, that? No, I decided not to practice that. Okay, good. And so that I was very rebellious in my teens and uh, afterwards. Um, can we talk about your personal style? You're known for your hats and sunglasses. I know. Um, why are these accessories so important to you? Well, whenever I go anywhere, I just go into a hat shop and uh, well, you know, it's my punishment or what it is, but I have so many hats <laughs> and so many glasses, you know, I don't know what to do. But <laughs> I go out and think, this one, huh? <laughs> <laughs> takes need, a long time. We need to start a hat museum one of these days. Right, right. Thank okay. you, Yoko. Thank nice you so much. It was great to do this. Yes, yeah, so exciting. Yeah. And there'll be more to come. This ah, is yeah, just the right. beginning. <laughs>